Hi guys and gals out in YouTube land, it's Miss Beverly. Back at you this evening with Brichet. What's up? Me. We are going to show you um, the new lace front that Brichet just got. I am... Um, Me. Oh, I'm sorry. Doodah's here. Let, let's get him in so he can say hi. Uh, hi. Say hi everybody in YouTube land. Hi. Hi in YouTube. Can you say YouTube? YouTube! <laughs> he loves looking at himself in the camera. He always points at it and goes, me, me, you know. So you say hi? Hi. Yeah, that's my boy. I love my boy. Okay. Okay, get down and let Mama do the wig review real quick. All right, so right now, um, I know I said I wouldn't do it, but I went on eBay and was looking at lace front wigs. And Brichet wanted another one. Um, she had done pretty good with lace fronts and um, she had been eyeing this one at, at the beauty supply store and they didn't have any colors in it. They didn't have her color in it. Um, and so I was looking around for it and I found it on eBay for 39, like 39.98 or 99, something like that. Um, I think right now they raised the price on it, um, and it's like $43.99 um, $43 or $43.79 right now. Um, normally at the beauty supply store, um, this lace front runs uh, right around $60 to $70 or better. So, yeah. Um, but this number here is a lace front from um, Bobby Boss. And here's the packaging for it. It's kind of a nice little packaging. And the unit that she got is, what is it? Camel. It's called Camel. It says MLF09 Camel. So basically Camel. And um, I got it on eBay, like I said. The um, company I bought it from is called Mimi Beauty Supply Plus. They're not related to the Mimi Beauty line on on YouTube. I know. I, I mean, on uh, um, on the web. I was really shocked. I was like, how many Mimi Beauties could there possibly be? <laughs> but I asked the Mimi Beauty line guy, and he was like, no, that's not us. Um, but this site really had really pretty good, um, not site, but um, seller, had really pretty good service. Um, they got it to me pretty quickly. I purchased it um, like the day before Thanksgiving and I got it, uh, um, when did we get it? Day before yesterday? Yeah. And we got it on Wednesday. So it took about a week to get here. They shipped it though um, like FedEx ground and FedEx ground is slow as molasses in the winter. Slow. So it wasn't the seller's fault. I purchased it. They shipped it right out the day after Thanksgiving. I mean, you know. Um, so here's the card again. And here's some of the other lace fronts that they have. Bobby Boss is one of my favorite wig companies. They just have some great, great wigs. And so it came with several little cards. Um, premium fiber wig. And it talks about the premium wig line. Um, handcrafted, lace, patch, whatever, I don't know. Um, and then it has some um, uh, basic care instructions for if you use tape or glue or without. You don't have to use either one, which Frichet doesn't. And uh, I actually was trying to talk her, you know, into taking it off so that we could show you guys. But what we'll try to do, because she hates to try to take it off because it's so hard to set, you know. So what we'll do is, is we'll try to show you the parting. Now she tends, she wears her lace fronts a little bit closer to like a half wig. Um, not quite as a half wig, but she pulls out about so much of her own hair and flat irons it. Okay. And, um, just a minute, Duda. So, let's bend down and get in the camera so that uh, we can see it. 
So here's Brichet. And um, Brichet, bend forward and let me see if I can get to. So about. It goes back pretty far. Hold on. Uh, let's see. Here it goes all the way back to here. So here. Now she has a black cap. Mm, scoot over here. Okay, so she has a black cap on. So I'm just going to have to try to show you. I don't even take the caps all the way out there anymore. Um. So we've got from he from here to here. Where's the measuring tape? Uh, from here to here is the parting. I hope you can see that. Would you bend your head down a little bit more? Again, you guys see from here to here is the parting. Um, and it's really hard to tell on her because she doesn't have a uh, skin or flesh tone wig cap on, so you can't really see it through the lace. Um, and it just had the, you know, the basic stuff. The hard, you know, the hard lace. Um, just like they all have. Um, and this lace, um, I guess it's a light brown color. It looked a little darker to me, but then when I held it up with the lace that I cut off of that full, or that um, lace front I got from China that has the soft lace, it's really um, just about the same, just about the same color. So um, maybe just a little bit darker. For, for you folks that are Caucasian, in case you're looking at, at getting one, you know, or your light skin, your lighter skinned um, folks, just so that you're aware, you know, how dark it is. Um, and the unit is uh, great. I mean, it is gorgeous. The hair is very, very natural, very soft. Um, can you back up, sis, just a skosh and bend down just a little bit so that we can show them? She's wearing a black shirt, which isn't really going to help us that much in terms of let's see what the <laughs> texture looks like. But you can kind of see it is a looser wave pattern. Um, and this unit is long. I mean, it was down past the boobs. Um, so we actually... Go it went ahead. all the way down here. Um, here is... And I'm going to just put my hand up here so you can see... Um, it's down past the bra line right now for her. Um, and here, let's see, let's hold this up here. Are you holding your head straight? Hold your head straight so I can. And here it is. So we trimmed a little bit off of it because it was all the way down here. Um, and so you can kind of, uh, let me turn the camera and turn it up so you can see her. Okay. So you see, um, kind of flip your hair a little bit, Brache, so we can see the movement. Um, pretty good, nice flowing, flowing movement to the hair. Um, the hair is a great texture. Um, I, uh, I found that um, it's really, look at that, after she's worn it all day, I can pick right through it with my pick. I mean, it, it, it's really, uh, Bobby Boss's units are just phenomenal. I mean, um, I, I, they're just great wigs. I mean, they're just great wigs. I've really... I can't even think of one that I've gotten from them. Oh, oh, I got one. And I've probably bought 20 different ones. And I've only gotten one. I bought that Lexi wig from them, and that was shit for me. But um, the, um, the hair is so natural. There's not a lot of shine on this number either. So, um, when you get it, it looks like human hair. Yeah, when you get it, it comes out and it, it, it looks just like human hair. And you can kind of see now that she's on that background, you can see what the texture uh, is in terms of the, um, the wave pattern. Um, and, uh, and she hasn't picked it out or anything probably. And, and she actually slept in this number last night um, and uh, put it up in, you know, put, put a satin cap on and put it up in a ponytail. And, uh, and it's not bonded on. She just has her own hair right here, flat ironed and pulled out. And you can see the part line. And what she's done is, is she has put this little um, yeah, get down here and show them. 
just a little thin uh, headband a little thin elastic headband on around her head right over the front of the lace so there there you it covers the front of the lace so the, the definition between the two you know between the lace and the skin and um, and looks like the part is fluid and goes right through the wig I mean it, it, it's really pretty creative actually and it helps the lace stains and and she thinks that it she thinks that it actually because there's no combs in this unit it not would, right here where they're supposed to be just in the back there's only one comb um, in the back um, so she feels like it really helps it to stay in place um, because you know we had the one um, lace front from the Janet collection that she put on and it just slipped back in the back of her head all the time we still have it. and um, and she and it was annoying for her. Um, part of it, I think, was because she had this giant poof in the back of her head because of her own hair. But, you know. But this time, I mean, she's flattened out her own hair very well. And, um, I mean, it just, this thing looks just like it's growing out of her head. I would highly, highly recommend it. I'm going to put around somewhere here the, um, link to this eBay seller um, and they have lots the person has lots of other units too um, so that you guys can check the t check the actual unit out and see um, they've got some uh, more specific information of, of the wig um, and uh, just know that you know we we love love I it recommend it Riche recommends it. it and she's very picky so really picky <laughs> Yeah. So, um, all right. So now this is, well, oh, I meant to say it also comes with uh, two strips of the Vapon uh, the top tape. stick, the good tape. Not that shit I've been working with. This is the good stuff. Um, so, yeah. Um, all righty then. So, uh, that is finally my last actual review for this evening. And uh, hopefully I'll be back at you soon um, with the other lace front that I've been waiting on forever. Uh, and that elf haul I told you guys about where I, I got the 251 piece set. The, they cut, had the different sets, you know, and they had them on sale for 33 bucks. Killer deal. So here's the lovely Brochet. And I'm Miss Beverly. Um, be sure to hit me up if you have any questions, and until next time, yeah, <laughs> rock on. Bye-bye.